It's Brett Lemoyne live in the town of Delafield Fire Station with how voters could shape the department next week. Yeah, and Ted, fire officials here call next week's vote critical if voters in two communities either approve a tax increase or tax fees, uh, excuse me, fire fees, then fire officials say they'll be able to get to emergencies a lot faster. Yes, it is a surprise to me. I had nothing. I didn't know anything about it. City of Delafield voters like Miranda Smith say Lake Country Fire and Rescue hasn't exactly ignited her interest in next week's election. I don't want to just jump the gun and vote yes for it if I don't really know it's what it's about. Referendums on the city and town's ballots ask voters if they want to increase department funds to hire more firefighters. Town of Delafield residents will approve or reject a tax increase, while City of Delafield residents will vote on a fire fee. What are you facing right now? When we don't have any part-time and paid on-call people uh, around that day or able to work on the schedule, it forces us to close fire stations. Chief Matthew Fenning says between last July and December, Delafield City Fire Station closed 50% of the time. Which has increased response times in 2022 by about 34%. Fenning says he's gotten few if any applicants for part-time positions. He says the solution is hiring full-time staff. The Lake Country Fire and Rescue Fire Board approved a four-year staffing plan last November. So it'll be an additional 13 headcount. An additional 13 people. And this is only for the first two years. I think there's some hope from the communities that we're going to hire these individuals next year and, and this year. And then they will, things will kind of settle out a little bit and there may be a change in the job market. The department services seven total communities, including the village of Neshota, where Mark Gast lives. So everyone wants to have a good fire department. Now, here in the town of Delafield, if you own a $500,000 home, you'd pay about $140 more per year if this is approved. The city fee is $450. There is an informational meeting that is taking place here at the fire station in the town of Delafield tonight. That's from 6 until 8 p.m. You can stop by if you have any questions. Reporting live in the town of Delafield, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. Information is key here. All right, Brett, thanks.